Bunny Films here with a brand new video, and today I'm bringing you my first furniture tutorial, and we'll be making a vault or safe. So what you need, you need five pressure plates that come from the Woods R Us store, or Link's Logic. You also need, oh, three, six, twelve, um, posts of any wood. I chose brown wood that comes from the, um, Bob Shack area, or across the bridge. Now, so you need eight cubes one by one little floor tiles so you you need these I chose gold wood but you can do whatever wood you want so and you also need a hatch a wire a lever and yeah and you need stuff to put in there and this is not gonna hold all of that but it's just that's this is like my loot room so you're gonna start off anyways by taking the golden cube or yeah golden cube and you're gonna place it in the corner like that and next you wanna get another one and place it four studs away from the other one. So, one, two, three, four, and then you want to go down one, like that. So that's four studs in the middle. And you want to do the same for the other side. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. And next, you want to get the other cube, and you want to place it right here. And it's going to be a functioning safe two guys so yeah so you want to take a post now um and you want to place it in between the two gold cubes like so and you want to do that to the next ones like this yeah and you want to place one right there and final one for now you want to place right here now for the planks or the um, pressure plates, you want to take it and you want to make sure you get it right. We're going to have the wood showing on the inside, like so. Wait, no, on the outside. So you want to flip it over so the outs the inside of the vault looks like metal, like so, like this, which is pretty cool. Next, you want to grab your next post and you want to prop it up like that. And I'm going to do that too. And place it on top of each cube, like so. And yeah. And next, uh, lag a bit. We're lagging a bit. Where is the blueprint? Or the, there we go. I place it right there. And now you want to take the pressure plate. You want to move it. Okay, YouTube, we are back. Sorry, guys, I lost connection. Anyways, let's resume the tutorial. You want to get another brown post or any colored post, and you want to place it on top of the golden cube. And next, you want to take the pressure plate, or one, and you want to position it so it looks like that. Yeah, that's good. And we're going to do the same to the other ones. So it's like, like that. And we're going to do it for the last one. Or the last little cube for now. Like this. And that's good for for now. And next you want to take the golden cubes. You want to place them each on top. Or one on top of each of the brown posts. Like so. And we are almost done with this. Next we have to do a little wiring. Which is really simple. If you can master the glitch I'm about to show you. And this glitch, some people think it will get you banned. You, it doesn't. It's just a simple wire glitch. But yeah. Anyways. Hold on. Let me, okay. So you take the last cube, or golden cube. And you'll need to place it on top of the post. And you want to take the posts and place them in between of each of the golden cubes. Like so. Let's take that one. Let's place it there. And you want to take one and place it there. And the final last post you want to take. Move and put it right there. So next you want to take the last pressure plate. These people are getting in front of me. And you want to place it on top like this. So that's the inside of the safe, guys. It looks pretty cool. I like it. Hope you do too. This is the outside so far, and now we have to do the door. 
So the door you want to place right here, you want to position it so it is inward like this. But you can place it outward, but it's just easier like this. Like that. Or hold on, guys. I'm, if, if there's a wall on the left side, it's going to be better if the door opens to that side, I think. If that makes any sense like that. But if you have a wall here, you want to do it like that. I don't know, guys. Don't mind me. Anyways, so you want to take the lever, and you want to press, er, oh, dang it. Um, actually, you need to place it the other way. I'm sorry, guys. Like that. You need to place it like this. And next, you want to take the lever, move, and place it on the wall right here. And now, guys, we need to take a wire. That's the last piece of this. You need to do my famous wire glitch. Or trick glitch. So you want to take the wire. You have to um, like get your camera in the wall, and then the wire will will go in the wall like this. And did not work. It takes a couple of tries, guys. So be patient with it. Like yeah, I didn't get this. Come on. It takes a bit of time. So. Yeah, let's just keep trying until we do it. Where is it? Uh, is the wire gone? Oh, there. What the heck? Okay, guys. So, yeah, you just want to keep continuing and see if you can actually do the glitch. If you can't, you might have to do... You might just have to move the door. But I'll be teaching you guys the actual way nothing on how to do an opening closing door with the wires hidden but you can also do them like so the wires are exposed but it's not very nice though and I'm just want to make this all neat and I'm lagging a bit hook okay. let's try it again yep. and even though um I'm not getting it it's actually pretty hard because, like, I I always use it now, but... Oh, there we go. There we go. We got it now. So you want to place it on the, um... Whatchamacallit? The little, um, hatch button, and you press finish. And there you go. Now let's test if this works. So you may see a little wire, but that's okay. Where am I ghost? Spooky. Okay, there we go. So you want to test the lever, and there you go. It works! So thank you for watching, and yeah. Now we're going to just put stuff inside, and yes, that's it. Thank you guys, and yeah, enjoy. And like and subscribe, and thank you guys for um, four, nearly 4,000 subscribers. We're 49 subscribers short, so that would be amazing when I reach 4,000. At 5,000, I might be doing a draw my life thing, because my life's not actually interesting right now. Yeah. Okay, so, anyways. I just want to have all the eyes the right way. Like this. And, uh, there we go. So, I'm also planning to put some end times wood in there with some end time axes because they're, this is really rare stuff I'm putting in there I mean because people have been always asking me for eyes so I'm afraid someone's going to one day steal them and I only have five but I also have many more hidden or no one will actually ever find Let's see if we can move this axe let's pick it up now see if we can get it. the eye there we go let's place it right there. Let's take the other. No, oh, so many axes. Let's just move all of these. And I want to thank my fans for actually getting me some of these axes. Uh, the names are countless, or endless. And yeah. So let's put the eye in there. And now uh, let's put some in terms of wood in there. These are my small little nuggets. I have a lot more. 
but and I also don't even plan going down there anytime soon because I think the biome will be in there for a while guys so don't worry because yeah I think people start soon forgetting about them over time I guess and like so then less people will be wanting to go down there and one eyes and that yeah anyways guys yeah um, let's just finish putting the last piece in and maybe some axes and then we should be done with my first furniture tutorial there we go now let's shove some axes in there you can also make this bigger guys hi Jose Boy. thank you so let's put some axes in there there we go Come on, there we go. Nope, there, we go. nope. Come on, there we go. Let's take this one because it's positioned really well. Let's put it in there. No, uh, if it doesn't fit, I don't know. Yeah, I think two's enough. Anyways, YouTube, thank you for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. I hope this was a great, fun tutorial that you followed. And if you want to find a great tutorial on how to build a massive golden axe model statue thing, like the one in front of my house or building like this, make sure you watch that tutorial as well. Thank you for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. And check my comment section. I gave a few people shout-outs, I think. So, yeah, goodbye, people.